Hello friends, welcome back to yet another video on Dr. Stokes. So today I have come up with again very interesting topic that is latest trends in passing percentages of DNB examinations. Yes friends, last year this video was most loved and most viewed video among my videos and it crossed around 19,000 views. So if you want to watch first and second part of this video then you can watch it from these links. And friends, uh, in this video I have compared latest DNB theory passing percentage along with June 2021 theory examinations because 2022 examination results with passing percentages are nowhere available in the website so I have to compare 2023 with 2021 I have observed some really very interesting trends and really very interesting patterns so friends I know each and every medico want to see this video and will not want to miss this video so friends please watch this video till the end in the end I will tell about very interesting patterns so Please watch this video till the end. Please like, subscribe and share this channel so that I can help each and every medic of this country. So without further wasting time, let's continue. I will take you to the screen. So forget everything and just concentrate on the screen. Let's get on with it. So friends, as you can see on the right side, April 2023 session DNB or DRNB theory examination results are there and passing percentage is mentioned. And by editing, I have added June 2021 passing percentages of theory along with the 2023 so friends uh, i have highlighted the passing percentages with three type of highlighters the green highlighter is revealing that passing percentages has decreased and red color or pink color highlighter is revealing that passing percentages has drastically decreased that is around 50 percent and the blue color or sky blue highlighter has depicted that passing percentages has increased so friends uh, let's see the screen you will find some very interesting and very important patterns so in anesthesiology you can see that pa that passing percentages has increased from 42 to 65 percent but in anatomy and biochemistry you can observe that there is slight decrease in passing percentages okay in anatomy it has decreased from 75 to 66 percent and in biochemistry it has decreased from 84 to 60 percent Friends, in cardiovascular and thoracic surgery, it has increased from 65 to 76%. But in cardiology, there is an issue. Yes, friends, there is an issue that it has decreased. Passing percentage in theory has decreased from 63 to 36%. Yes, friends, it's really very concerning. So, it's basically for the DRNB, that is super specialty subjects. Uh, now, we will look for the dermatology. It Again, it has decreased a bit from 86.9 to to 78.46 in endocrinology again it has decreased from 75 to 50 percent in family medicine it has increased from 78 to 90 percent in forensic medicine you can see again it's a severe drastic decline hence i have highlighted it in pink color so it has decreased from 75 to 37 percent so in two subjects you have seen that it has drastically decreased till now first in cardiology then in uh, forensic medicine Friends, uh, in uh, medical gastroenterology, again it has decreased. Again, it is a super specialty subject that is DRNB. In general medicine, trend has increased from 73 to 79%. That is a really good thing for medicine lovers. In general surgery, it's uh, bit on the same side, 68.16 to 68.72%. In urology, again it's an increase from 90 to 100%. In hospital administration, it has decreased from 33 to 0%. And in uh, immunohematology and blood transfusion, it has decreased from 80 to 77%. And in medical oncology, it has increased from 63 to 75%. And in microbiology, it has increased from 60 to 73%. So friends, um, in these subjects, it's uh, more or less same. In nephrology, again, there is a concern that passing percentage has decreased from 100 to 31%. And uh, in neurosurgery, it's a really good thing that passing percentages has increased from 17 to 61%. Uh, in neurology, as you can see, in neurology, it has decreased from 91 to 75%. Again, it is a super specialty subject that is DRNB. So friends, in nuclear medicine, there's a really good thing that it has increased from 57 to 77%. In obsgyny, it's more or less same. In ophthalmology, it, again, it has increased from 65 to 86%. Oh my god, in orthopedics, again, there is a big, big concern, friends. Again, I am very worried about the orthopedicians, especially those who are taking DNB. 
so friends again there is not much increase in passing percentages of dnb theory examination that is just increased from 18% to 24.33% it's really very concerning so before taking it i think you should consider you should think not twice not thrice at least 10 times you should think before taking dnb orthopedics friends this is very concerning for me in ent it has really increased from 33.96 to 75% that's a real good thing in pediatric surgery it's a big concern that it has fallen from 100 to 25% in pediatrics and pathology it's again a very good news that it has almost doubled passing percentage has doubled in pediatrics and pathology and ent so it's a very good news coming from for these three subjects and friends uh, for uh, physical medi- medicine and rehabilitation you can see passing percentage has declined from 100 to 61% physiology again it has declined from 62 to 33% plastic and reconstructive surgery again you can see it has de- uh, declined from 92 to 65% so it's not a good thing uh, and friends in uh, secretary you can see it has increased from 65 to 70% radio diagnosis more or less same radiation oncology increased from 66 to 81% and uh, respiratory medicine again more or less same you cannot say that it has increased or decreased rheumatology more or less same the concerning is community medicine it has decreased from 70 to 36% that is almost half and surgical gastroenterology again it has declined from 90% to around 75% and in surgical oncology it's a really good news that it has increased from 38 to 100% and in emergency medicine again a very good news that it has increased from 38.98% and 89.08% so friends uh, i will stop the recording now so friends i know you all must be excited to know the patterns you must uh, you must have observed in the screen so friends uh, uh, i have noticed that in most of the broad specialty subjects passing percentages are more or less same or they have increased so it's a really good news for dnb students who are who are willing to take broad specialties but friends there is a big concerning factor that in most of the super specialties except oncology that is surgical oncology and medical oncology in most of the super specialties passing percentages are decreasing yes friends it's quite concerning for the drnb students as a notion it was prevailed among the medicos that passing percentages in drnb are much better so you can easily take the drnb but in this video for the first time in india i have observed that passing percentages are declining in drnb so friends uh, again it's a concerning factor for drnb students but for broad specialty only some subjects like orthopedics is a concerning factor uh, but in most of the subjects passing percentages are increasing and are on the same level as you have already seen in the video so friends i hope you all will like this video please like subscribe and share this channel so that you can help me in helping the other medicos in changing their lives and taking the good decision towards their post graduation and super specialty journey please like subscribe and share this channel i will see you in the next video till then myself dr nishant signing off stay blessed